welcome back to beautiful Munich, Germany. The first American woman to land a triple axel in the Nationals, Tanya Harding. She did it again here on this ice at Olympia Hall in her free program as she went on to the silver medal. <laughs> Chain Melody, revived for the movie Ghost, a wonderful love story, and she is a, a rare married U.S. champion, the first since 1962, Barbara Rolls won the U.S. title as a married competitor then. I think Tanya has done incredibly well under all the pressures and the strain, first of all coming in as a u new United States champion. The pressure of the triple axel, the battle with Ito and Yamaguchi, taking a silver medal here. She should be extremely proud of herself. And all of that, uh, fighting the problems that come to any athlete with asthma, and uh, having an encore presentation has to put some pressure on her in that regard. but she said I hit it when I counted.
20-year-old Tanya Harding from Portland, Oregon. Silver Tanya medal, Harding. 1991. By the way, her husband Jeff not here to cheer her on during the competition, but is going to join her shortly to celebrate their first anniversary here in Europe. The announcer is asking Tanya to go out and try another triple axel. Cody, you want me to do a triple axel? He doesn't uh, seem too eager to go back. They did this to her in Minneapolis, and she did go out and produce it, but. This, this is, is a whole packed. different. Uh, this is a whole nother ball game she's here. Been skating for four <laughs> minutes, four or five minutes. She's out of breath. This is tough. Dodie Teachman, her coach for the last three and a half years, uh, said, "Oh, go ahead, give it a try." Here she comes. It's very difficult when you know the eyes of over 8,000 people are on you. Reduce. That's what we call popping. <laughs> she popped into a single. And to give it one more chance, she says. <laughs> and a good sport about it all, Tanya Harding. The height that she gets is incredible. And she didn't miss by much. It's been a great year for Tanya Harding and a great day in Munich. We'll be right back.